Hi, I'm Bob Ryan. This is Globe 10.0. With me today is Chad Finn. We're in the enviable position, at least in compared to fans and media in other cities, uh, where the Patriots have their destiny uh, fairly much in their hands and in terms of playoff. They're already in the playoffs. Okay, fine. Root, root, root for those 49ers tonight because if they were to beat the Steelers, that would open the door for the Patriots to get the number one seed. Yeah, hard as it is to believe with uh, the frustrations people have had with the Patriots. Like, <laughs> it, it they would be, be the only 11-win team in the conference if Pittsburgh loses tonight. It would be amazing. And if they, uh, that uh, with all the, the uh, well-known and well-discussed strengths and weaknesses of the defense. Uh, but the fact is that you do have to uh, root for those uh, 49ers because uh, the, the Patriots would lose uh, an 11, a 13 and three matchup with Pittsburgh, or yeah. 12 and four if it came to that, because of the fact that the Steelers beat them, and that would be the first consideration would be head to head. Uh, are you uh, when they were five and three? What are you thinking? Tell me. I was thinking that they were probably still the best team in their division, but it was going to be a dogfight with the Jets. The Jets. The Jets have uh, certainly been exposed to, in, in certain ways and, and um, have played themselves out of this. Uh, they're, they're, they're not out of the playoffs, but uh, they, they have some work, work to do. Uh, Baltimore, what are they, how do they stack up in a big picture for you after surprisingly losing a game on Sunday? It's strange to see their defense be uh, at fault for uh, what goes wrong with them. I mean, Joe Flacco is so up and down that yeah. it's, they're always going to ride that way. But their defense is a steady thing. To see the Chargers play they did the way they did with their inconsistencies against that Baltimore defense, you don't know what to expect the Chargers, from them. The Chargers remain an enigma, enigma. And, uh, and they're still alive. And uh, meanwhile, the, uh, the, the Texans, who were riding high and appeared to have found a, a satisfactory answer at quarterback, Lost the game. We weren't looking for them to lose, so uh, that 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 knocks them back. And Patriots, you know, pretty much you can you can't say they have all their destiny in their hands. They need a little boost here from San Francisco. But the worst that can happen if they win out, Chad, is is second seed. Well, you know, not bad. Good place to be, and it depends who you're playing uh, when you're that first seed. And That's right. Playing whoever's in that fourth slot. I mean, maybe the second seed is where they want to be. But we must remind you that uh, the Patriots have not won a playoff game anywhere, uh, home or away, since. 2008.